Good evening. If you are just joining us, you're live at St. Mary's in the FA Youth Cup for Southampton against Portsmouth. The fans have turned out in force, a really good effort by them. And Saints fans are in the itching stand, Pompey are in the Kingsland, and we're all set for the 7 p.m. kickoff. Let me bring you the all-important team news. It's the game that all of them want to play in, but only 11 can. Jason Dodd has named his side, and there are four changes from the one that beat Leicester on Saturday. Harry Eistard is back in goal, replacing James White, who stepped up for the first appearance of the season on Saturday. The back four, Tom Leggett is at right back, Matthew Target at left back, Kyle Clinton and Josh DeBio are the defensive pair. In front of them, Jake Flanagan and Niall Mason are the holding midfielders. It's then Marcus Barnes, Jake Esketh and Josh Sims with Sam Gallagher up front. A 4-2-3-1 formation is what we're expecting. They were quite uh, the threat against Aston Villa. Gallagher's got down the left-hand side, plays a ball in towards Hesketh who shoots and scores! <laughs> Jake Hesketh opens the scoring in the FA Youth Cup. He's guided the ball past the goalkeeper from about three yards out. Great ball for in from Sam Gallagher. And the players bundling each other in front of the Saints fans away to our right-hand side. We've played nearly 27 minutes in St. Mary's. It's Southampton 1, Portsmouth 0. So, so calm in front of goal from Jake Hesketh there. That is just typical of him. That's just epitomised how he's been recently. Calm outside of the foot, flicks into the far corner. That is Jake Eskett all over. Fantastic finish. Well, it was a fantastic ball in from Sam Gallagher. He won the ball down the inside left channel. He drilled the ball in towards the near post and it fell to Hesketh, who just instinctively threw out a foot. We've played 44 minutes at St. Mary's. Targets ball in towards the near post. Flanagan can't get there. It's cleared off the line and then it's hacked in. <laughs> Southampton have doubled their lead in the FA Youth Cup. It was a ball in from Matthew Target. The first shot was cleared off the line, but the second one was struck home. And Southampton under-18s have doubled their lead as we approach the half-time interval. Mason with a striker's instinct there. That's great to see. See the ball bounce down there. He's first to it to slam it home. That's fantastic to see. No Portsmouth player was getting near that then. No challenge whatsoever. And he took that in perfectly right into the bottom right-hand corner. Southampton have gone with a free kick whilst Portsmouth weren't looking. Target low Ooh. shot and it's saved by the goalkeeper and it falls to a Portsmouth player. But only as far as Heth goes through, drills it. Gallagher on the rebound. 3-0 Southampton. Sam Gallagher picks up the, uh, the rebound off of Jake Hesker's shot. He was about six yards out and he diverted it past the goalkeeper and into the net. And that should be game set and match as far as Southampton are concerned because they're cruising into the FA Youth Cup fourth round at 3-0. That free kick really, really took them off guard. The Portsmouth just didn't know how to deal with that. Sam Gallagher is in the perfect position, striker's instinct just to lash that home while the keeper was down on the floor and couldn't react in time. Unfortunately, straight at the goalkeeper, but had he got that away? Hesketh puts it past Watmore, Hesketh through one on one, shoots and scores! Unbelievable. What a finish from Jake Hesketh. It was Gascoigne-esque as he took it past Watmore, chipped him and then struck it past the goalkeeper and Southampton have made it 4-0 with just over an hour gone in the FA Youth Cup. Portsmouth has simply stunned there and the way he just flicked it over Watmore's head and just left him completely grounded. He did the same with the goalkeeper as well. When he curled that shot, the keeper just didn't move whatsoever. He just watched that fly right past him and into the corner and they just couldn't do anything about that, whether it be the defence or the goalkeeper. What a fantastic goal. Gallagher into Flanagan. Flanagan skips past the challenge. Does well to stay on his feet. Plays it wide right to Leggett. Leggett has Gallagher if he wants to use him at the far post. Leggett drives towards the byline. Dinks the ball into the, towards the centre of the goal. Gallagher with the header. And that's 5-0 for Southampton. Sam Gallagher gets his head on Tom Leggett's cross and just steers it past the goalkeeper who lies in the six-yard box. He couldn't do anything about that. 5-0 to Southampton. Such an inviting cross there from the right-hand side. It really plays to Sam Gallagher's strength, the way he just dinked up, and it was simply a battle of who could rise the highest, and of course, that was always going to be Gallagher who was going to win that, and he just nodded it in with so much confidence into the corner. It just looked so easy. Here's Nahimi for Southampton. Low ball down the line looking for the run of Matt Target, who's advanced well. Matt Target has Gallagher in the centre. He finds Gallagher, it hits his knee, hits the post and goes in! Sam Gallagher has a hat-trick. I'm not quite sure he meant that. It hit him on the knee, went in off the post. The goalkeeper cuts a frustrated figure inside his own six-yard box. But Sam Gallagher has a second-half hat-trick at St. Mary's, and it is 6-0. Matt Target couldn't even disguise a laugh there. He couldn't believe what he was seeing himself. Sam Gallagher didn't know the first thing about that. It just seemed to bounce off his knee, and just, the keeper just couldn't believe what was going on. He was completely out of position and he just bounced in off the near post, 6-0. <laughs> well, yeah, I think um, 
That one would have to probably be the luckiest of the uh, six goals that Southampton has scored this evening. The ball in from uh, Target. To be fair, Target advanced well. Target did his job perfectly. That was a great ball in for him there. And that was epitomised by how all he had to do was lift his kneecap up and then <laughs> in it went. Well, and here comes Saints again because Flanagan's got the ball. And Irvine's inside right channel. Irvine might make it seven. He does! Oh. It's 7 0 in the FA Youth Cup. Southampton are cruising into round four. Irvine, the substitute, has made it 7 0. And Portsmouth just look around. They can't believe it. That's uh, that's Irvine's first attempt, that's his first sight of goal, and yet he remains so calm and composed. And he just slotted that across the goalkeeper, across the face of goal, and into the far corner. Fantastic. Well, two goals in a minute for Jason Dodd's side. 7-0 they lead.